We're recording. Regular Joe here. So, a lot of people in the community have been asking some really good questions about the intellectual property laws and clearances around some of the art that we're making, especially now that we're making it for a TV show. So, I thought I would sit down and have a conversation with Donna. She is our clearance expert, and she's working for our show, making sure that everything's uh, on the up and up and legal with clearances and intellectual property laws and stuff. That's it. Thanks for being here, Donna. You're welcome. <laughs> First thing uh, I wanted to talk about is when you're putting up records with your friends or your relatives or someone other than yourself. What is the law around that? This is what we do. Mm -hmm. Say I'm shooting my friend, Joe, mm -hmm. and I'm a member of the site and I upload my record. Joe's not a member of the site. The most important thing, get Joe to join the site, click the box. Mm -hmm. No more problems. Mm -hmm. Here's a really good example. Uh, in our Tournament of Champions, the recorder, Kearney, has been shooting these fantastic videos of her grandma, Mary. Now, technically, we don't yet have I don't Karen's think... grandma's permission, is that right? We do not, but we love Mary, and <laughs> Mary needs to join the site and become a member, and all she needs to do is click the box. Okay. That's it, and she's in. So, Karen, get Mary to join the site and sign up for an account and check the box, and then everything's kosher. And anybody else, if you're making something with other people who aren't on the site, if they want their work to be on our show, they have to join the site. Pretty simple. And one way to make sure that we know who is working on your record that you've uploaded is when you're citing your resources, cite the profile picture, the portrait of your collaborators, of whoever else is in the video with you or sang on the song with you or anybody else who worked on your record in any way. That way we know everyone's okay and everyone's a member, which we want them to be anyway. Donna's keeping good track of it. The next thing I want to ask you about is public domain. We love public domain. Me page. too. We use a lot of it here. Since you're the expert, I'm curious to get your like, definition of what exactly is public domain. Public domain is any sort of record that is not copyrighted by a citizen of the United States. So it's free to use for everyone. A lot of it's at the Library of Congress, where as a United States citizen, it belongs to you. We get a lot of our footage from a site called archive.org. Some of you guys send us footage that you say is public domain. So even though you guys say it is, it's my job to double check that it is public domain. You can do this yourself on the archive.org or whatever public domain site you're using. There should be a license called the Creative Commons license. It's usually a little link at the bottom. So if someone wants to use some footage that they downloaded off archive.org, mm -hmm. can they say email you to make sure it's cool? I would hope that you email me. Please do. If you have any doubt in your mind or any question, if it is, just ask me and I'll tell you. All right, and we set up an email account for this. It's clearance at hitrecord.org and Donna is reading those emails. So send them in and I'll answer them. That's it. Hopefully that should clear up some questions. Thanks again, Donna. You're welcome. All right.